Stephanie, what are you doing? Antonia. <laughs> what are you doing? Uh. Hey. Hi. Hi. How are you? You doing good? You have a good day? Hey, everybody. Hey, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> What's up everybody? Hope you guys are doing well. It is Brandon and as you see over there is Mama Bear, the fiance, the love, the one and only. I don't know why you holding this so high. This sanitizer like it's a prize medal right. to be won. <laughs> Just high. High and lifted. And this is heavy. Hey y'all, it really is heavy. I was over there like that was light. This is heavy. And then they go into Nia. Welcome to another video and another vlog of life with Brandon and Alex. I was off today, so I went and got my hair done. As you see, got that fresh retwist. Lock gang strong. Lock's getting long. We here. My barber got me right. It's a celebrate. And then, pretty much after that, Antonique hit me up because she wanted to go have a little lunch date. So we went to World of Beer mm -hmm. and uh, we sat up there, had some, what was those fries called? Uh, truffle fries. Parmesan truffle fries. Parmesan truffle fries. And then we had some little margaritas mm -hmm. and then we had ordered some flatbread pizza and it was the bomb. Like I got some left. I think you have what? Like the tiniest, y'all. You can have some of mine. I have. Two pieces left. You got to pull up. Why did my child eat two of them? Mmm, mommy, good. Mmm, mommy, more. And I'm like, you want another one? Cause I didn't want to share. Like, if you know anything about flatbreads, it's not a lot. It's small. She gets her third, her third slice, guys, and decides. Ew, mommy, I don't want it. You ate two of them. How on God's green earth did you get to the third one and decide that you didn't like it and wasted my flatbread? I ain't ate all day. We were supposed to place it. We well, we placed the DoorDash order. Me and my coworkers placed the DoorDash order. DoorDash is playing games, okay? And they got Dash passes. I don't. DoorDash literally. Oh, your order's on its way. Oops, something happened. We're looking for a, a dasher to get you your order. Kept changing the time. Kept changing the time. Kept changing the time. Before you knew it, the kids' lunch was over and our planning period was over and they still hadn't delivered our food and at this point we've been waiting over an hour and I said, run me my money because there's no excuse. So I literally had two cups of coffee. And that was it. So yeah, we had to get some food. Um, I need to, oh, look at all this dang on hands in this other one. This is the second one and I got like this. They give them to you free at the teacher warehouse. And, um, we are so grateful. We are so, so grateful for the free hand sanitizer in this season. Um, only problem is, is that I've gotten so many of them that I don't know where to put them. Um, but these are like the small ones, which are great because these are the ones that I keep in my purse, the ones that I keep in Tania's um, bag for her. Like we can toss these in the car. Um, anybody ever need hand sanitizer when we out and you know when you like, oh yeah, girl, I got some hand sanitizer. And then before you know it, it's pew, nothing in there. So yeah, I racked up. I hear the beads. Antonia. <laughs> What I'm doing, talking to the camera, what you doing? I just told you, I'm talking to the camera, what you doing? <laughs> yeah, y'all, so that's a little bit about my day. We are currently getting ready. We are currently getting ready to head to our church because 
what is it like a questionnaire? It's a, it's what a is millennial it? question Q and well, a millennial Q and A with our pastor and Prophet Todd Hall. Yes, they're going to be answering questions that people have in regards to church, in regards to life, in regards to marriage in regards to being single any questions in regards to like what the bible says what the bible don't say what you know all that good stuff so it's gonna be good come here Anthony. yeah so we are getting ready to go to that and then after that greensboro here in labour park on their lawn they are showing in kanto um it's free to the public Stop, so Stop. we are going to go out there with Antonia. she actually has never seen in kanto we do have disney plus um, but Antonia watches her regulars, her favorites. If it ain't Minnie Mouse or Mickey Mouse or PJ Masks or Baby Shark, she not. Or Cinderella. Her new thing, y'all, is Cinderella. She will sit and watch Cinderella 1, 2, and 3 back to back and then ask for you to play it over. Um, that's her new thing. That's in, it's in the wrong, the wrong hole. <laughs> I need you to be Daddy scared. over here fighting with her. But yeah, so that's what we're about to do. Mama's about to change clothes because um, the dress outfit was cute for the day. But um, it's going to get real chilly. And I do not like being cold. I'm definitely going to be in need of my third cup of coffee. I will be sure to get it. Mark my words. <laughs> Alright, y'all. So we are about to make our way to the movie on the lawn at uh, the LaBauer Park downtown Greensboro to see in, uh, what is it called, Encanto? Encanto. Encanto. Yeah. Um, so we're about to make our way to that. Y'all, the Millennial Move Q&A was, good. was amazing. It was good. They were still trying to finish up when we was on our way but um, to here, but it was really, really good. They're gonna have to continue that again and do like some series Watch because these questions are needed and the answers that were given were necessary. Um, so let's make our way to this. And hopefully it's, hopefully it's a space for us out here because we're late to the movie, but hopefully we got somewhere to sit. Go, go. 